Acadie Bathurst T10. Out for Halifax. Now here's Cedric DeRusso the other way to give and go. Scores! Nothing but net. Oh, Jay. 13 in a row. Cedric DeRusso. Corey's got all the numbers. Man, you said uh, you said Crosby had 14 on the line. He gives it up. He can shoot right there. Oliver, the 16-year-old, right back on the tape. And Cedric DeRusso with his goal. 13 now in a row. And he is one behind. Sid the kid. Wow. This is an unbelievable thing we're witnessing here right now. And it is. I mean, and he is going to charge up off that right wing. Chip and charge. He'll play the puck in as well. Yeah. Looping up and down is Budgel on the give and go. Coming to the blue line. Plendowski scores! Oscar Plendowski scores his first Quebec Major Junior Hockey League goal as this one. It's a tipper back shot. He let it go, and it gets through the goal lines as a Quebec major junior hockey league player. Well, I had an inkling that Oscar may get one here you tonight. Did. And just he had that kind of hop in his step, and he wants to be an offensive defenseman, and when you want to be one and you have that ability, it wears on you. And he's had some great looks, hits the post early, but he just walks in. Guy Schwenard says his one-timer is unbelievable. Well, Liam Payton. Swan again off the wall, chips it off. Bit of check, choke time, he's in free. 2 nothing hockey game, down, goaltender's down, scores! Oh, I'll tell you what, some slick stick work by Vitacek. Draws goaltender Gooby to the stick side, reaches back in the reverse, and then parks it on the glove side. Of I love him heading into his draft here. I don't know how he gets so far in behind. A couple of fakes and pulls to the backhand, and he puts that one right in past the post on the glove side of Jacob Gooby. And just like that, the Mooseheads on the board here. Two to one. Over handles it. As we get a chance now for Jones, and he is going Top to be. Of center ice, Zach Jones plays the puck, and Trudeau <laughs> steps right into him. There's a couple going to be no allowing. Mid blue line, 64 feet away. Stepping in from 35 feet. Saucered off in front. Stick side. Oh, what a stop. Two one game. He doesn't give up on it. Isles thought they had their third. And second power play goal, DeRusso. Wires one, scores! Oh, said money. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. After just a terrific save by Brady James. This one, oh. when they've got the that gift to score goals, they score goals. Yeah, he could be driving home with that full cage on, with that, that full shield. <laughs> he might never take it off again. And you're right, Brady James, an outstanding save early on the sequence, and Cedric goes back to the old well, the five hole. Nice. And Through center ice, stripped off the puck. There is going to be Casey. He's in all alone. Steps in, fires. Nice save made as that one is blocking away. There's a shot. They score. I'm not sure how that one is going to go in as Budgel. It looks like he's going to put a bar down as the first. Big, let's watch it right here. Well, here. Casey, great save by Jay. Casey stays with it. Little tap and Budgel. Tap, tap, tap. tap a Top shelf. 4-1. Watch this. This comes off the glass. It must. It comes off. Casey. Anyway, he, he takes it to Budgel, and Budgel just roofs it. But that's a that's going to be a bunted pass by Casey. There it is. Yeah. He wow. gets the assist. Great. By Jacob Gooby, one-on-one -on -one with Elliot Denoye. Again, he curls in back, tries to bring it around. Low glove side. Does he score? It looks like he does. On a crank around low, and he will bring it low to the glove side. Gooby. Uh, it's just a kind of a scramble in front, and the Islanders lose their man, and it is Denoye, the hot one. He's got the hot stick for the Mooseheads. And Plandowski comes one side, he goes the other. A wraparound attempt, and Gooby just can't get the pad jammed up. And so, with 2.45 to go, the Moose have a bit of life here. As he swipes it around. Deep, their power play is 60, so there's some ugly numbers there, but there's a shot. Save made, rebound in front, they score! Isles on the opportunity of the power play. Are going to go three for three. Gets a cross ice, De Rousseau fires a shot, and... I don't know if Casey even touched it. I think it might be De Rousseau with the goal. Casey, I don't even think, got a piece of it. In back is the... I think it's De Rousseau with the hat trick. De Rousseau, look. Scotty McLean in the truck. That's, he's at the if top there's of one it. good thing about pandemic, he's back working with us. LaRue will be back on the roster on Saturday night in downtown Halifax. Big game expected there. Barron will not be there. Along with Cormier, they... Do some. He is uh, he's certainly a, a young player here that never takes a step back. He's face first every time, and he's loved by his teammates and the 
and the coaching staff for the complimentary uh, effort again tonight for his team. In front, shot, oh, what a stop! As this one brick walled, another opportunity as Brady Jake finally is going to shot. He had the blocker probably turned back and he caught that one in the middle of the, uh, the back half of the uh, blocker. Oh, 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 that's Q save of the week right there. Yeah. Brady James has been fantastic. What a stop there. Uh, William Trudeau, how about his game? I mean, he just does what he wants out there. Doesn't look to be any worse to wear. He's parked off in front, petting off in front. There's a shot right off. Save made again as they are going to turn on it, trying to get the shot through. They score. Vitacek finally, and the Halifax Mooseheads with 31 seconds left. And Brady James making saves, and next thing you know, 2.52 to go here. Yep. It's still a two-goal game. Puck and was down and free. Gooby made a couple of saves. He was stack-packing the pads to the uh, stick side, but just couldn't reset. And Vitacek finds an opening, and he'll beat the goaltender Gooby. As you just said, still almost three minutes left here. And Halifax